what is up guys welcome back to uh, another youtube video and if you're new hello um today i'll be showing you my first pokemon showdown battles i'll be doing a lot more pokemon showdown battles so make sure you subscribe if you want to see some incredible battles um i've gone for randomized battles because they're less sweaty and i find them more fun like you, you can have some weird stuff go on and fun it's just really fun really so i'll be showing you three battles that i did um yeah without further ado let's get into them so the first battle we have here is my first ever pokemon showdown battle i haven't done one before i was just like going straight into it see what it was like and i really enjoyed it this battle is against freddy ketchum so yeah this battle was very fun actually it's my first ever battle so let's let's play and see so he sent out his zernius and i had Uxie. i didn't know this so i went for u-turn out to switch into Kyron, which is a bad switching i don't know what i was doing but weirdly his zernius went thunderbolt and then a moon blast obviously bad switching for me i don't know what i was thinking moon goose is in this is a good switch for me because it goes dynamax Tank that max star for, and then I sludge bomb and take a lot of HP, and I get a flex sludge, and then max lightning. And I was thinking, what, what are they doing? So I toxic the uh, Azurians, and then max mind storm me. I don't know why I didn't do that from the start, and I sludge bomb to try and get down, but it didn't take it out. So lost their Dynamax, and I'm on red health, and then the Heracross comes up. Right, I'm gonna pause it here. Listen to this. This cool fish here saved literally made me win. And if you don't know, which is probably no one, Quillfish is my least favourite Pokemon. And I'll go into a little backstory now. So imagine like a few years ago I was I was smaller, yeah? Um playing Auras, you know, just like you do. And uh I was hatching some eggs I randomly had. So I hatched it and a shiny fennekin and i was i didn't really know but i was just like what the heck is this pokemon this is insane and i was like it looks so cool i kind of knew it was shiny but i didn't really like react to like i would do now and yeah i i loved it um i kept it at level one pretty much and then i went to do some link trades because you know i like trading and trying to scam people like trading a female who piled on for a shiny Pokemon, that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, so I went on, and this this person offered me a shiny quillfish. I'm pretty sure it isn't hacked because it's got it hasn't got like good IVs, and um, who would trade a shiny quillfish? Come on. Um, but yeah, a shiny quillfish. I was like showing off my Fennekin, and I don't know what I was thinking, but I traded. I literally traded that shiny fennekin for that shiny quillfish and to this day I have regrets of that moment I'm like this quillfish literally tempted me in to give away this amazing shiny fennekin that I haven't done anything with like it's just so annoying that's why I hate quillfish and it just looks a bit odd as well so yeah that's my story behind quillfish uh, I mean in the future I might hunt for a shiny fennekin if it comes into a game that I want to hunt it in um in the future to make me feel not as bad but yeah that's kind of my backstory behind that quillfish that's why i don't really like really like it but it was actually the hero in this battle i'll show you why so the hero cross comes in i toxic spikes now that is a play it knocks off my black sludge but i'm not too bothered and i destiny bond watch this cloak but like you know i just i just don't take it out so um, I go for the waterfall hoping to get that flinch, but no, it's gonna make on. I'm 0 HP pretty much. <laughs> 1 HP, sorry. So I went for the. What's it like? Destiny Bond. Yeah, I did. I went for the Destiny Bond, so it's gonna. L somehow misses that stone ink. That was so annoying. And the light hand mock's going down. And then the abominous snow comes in. So I was like, yeah, it's Destiny Bond. Yeah, it's gonna take me out, and I'm gonna take it down with that quillfish. Quillfish, the hero somehow. Now, Amoongus comes in with the regenerator and gets health back up. 
sludge bomb's not gonna be enough to take me out. I'm gonna sludge bomb back at Seismic Toad. And I'd get some black sludge, he gets toxic damage from the top spikes, and I'll go into Ooxie. Just gonna tank that sludge bomb and luckily don't get that top poison. And then yeah. In comes a flapple, which is gonna get toxic spikes as well. And at this point I think it was starting to get triggered. Although it did have a lumberry, so it did get around it. But I switch into Frost Lass, we're gonna switch out back to the Xerneas, which I'm gonna try and KO. And I managed to take out one ice beam. So Flapple's back in, gets the toxic spikes, is getting triggered. He's like, how can I get the poison spikes away? And I said defog, and he was like, I don't have defog, I'm out. So that was my first ever battle, and uh, yeah. Let's get into the next one. Okay, for this battle we have L Lin HC um, or Link, I guess. Um, now this battle was um, well, it's, it it doesn't take very long. Let's just say that. So let's get straight into it. Um, yeah, this is this is gonna be a really fast one. So we set up soon. I have Zatu. I'm gonna set up the screen. It's gonna knock off through a big chunk of jam damage. Take off my light clay, and yeah, switch inside the and absolute tank that knock off. And then this Aerodactyl that comes out, miss drawing that one wing beat, but that won't matter. So I switched into um, the Cosma, the dust main, and the earthquakes. And look at this weakness policy, sun steel strike right into the Aerodactyl, taking it straight out, and that's the end. Yeah. Okay. Okay, for the last battle, I have Sky the Kid. Um, this was a really good battle. I'm surprised it didn't rage quit when um, I had another weakness policy in the Crossma Dust Me. But um, I'm gonna let you watch this one. You don't need my commentary really because um, it was just an awesome battle. So, without further ado, here's the battle. Okay, so <clears throat> I misplayed a lot there, a lot, a lot, and um, yeah, I could have definitely got better, but it was a very good battle, I really enjoyed it, despite the fact we lost, um, yeah, um, I could have definitely made better plays there, I don't know why I did some moves, but that's my battle, and um, that's my first Pokemon Showdown video, I hope you guys enjoyed Make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.